I first met Adriana, I thought, I honestly knew I was going to marry her. My favorite thing about Adriana is probably her mindset. She's just so easygoing. Yeah, she balances me out, you know. I'm excited to see Adriana and uh, just having everyone around. I like having the whole family together. It's fun. Adriana, first of all, I want to say thank you for giving me the most precious baby girl in the world. I also want to thank you for always having my back. There are so many things I can sit here and say thank you for, but I'll sum it up by simply saying thank you for loving me. Every day, good or bad, just thank you for loving me the way you do. Just knowing on the good days that we get to have plenty more, and on the bad days that at the end of the day, I get to lay in bed and fall asleep with the love of my life gives me peace. You are my rock and you are my forever home. It's an incredible feeling being loved by you. You give me the motivation and confidence to want more out of this amazing life we have together. You truly bring out the best of me. I truly would be lost in this life if I didn't have you with me to figure it out with. So with all that being said, thank you for choosing me to be here for to be here forever, Chicklet. In this life together, I promise to always love you. Love you the best I can and give you the best of me every day and love you unconditionally. I promise to be your best friend and I know I'm not always the most patient person, but I promise in time I'll be the most patient motherfucker you know. <laughs> I promise to strive to be the best dad to Andy and all our other future babies. I want to give you guys the best life. That's truly what I want more than anything is to give you and our babies the best life possible. I'm going to work on doing that every day. I promise to never be too busy to give you and the family of ours my time and love. There's so much in this life I want to do with you and you by my side. I never want to lose that fun, adventurous side of you that I love. Sometimes I get tired because of work and I feel like some of our weekends are go, go, go. But to be honest, I love it. You truly are the love of my life. In a sense, we grew up together and kind of figured out this adulting thing out together. We have been inseparable since I was 18 and you were 16. I'm thankful for all the times we had together, especially the tough times, like when we had to cash our coins to pay bills and steal groceries in North Dakota because I feel like those times brought us closer together and honestly made us a stronger couple. I love you forever. Devin, I can't believe it is our wedding day. Thank you for giving us a second chance to celebrate our love. You are such an amazing man, husband, and dad. I cannot even believe I landed a catch like you sometimes. You are more than I ever dreamed of. You are the epitome of exactly what I wanted for my daughter. She is so blessed to have you as a father. You are my person, my absolute best friend, and even on our worst days, I choose you, and I will always choose you. Thank you for all you do for me. You bend over backwards for us every single day. You work so hard to give us everything we needed more. I wake up and live such a dreamy, carefree, happy life alongside you. I wrote you some promises to honor our love today. I promise to fill your life with laughter and happiness. I promise to keep our love exciting, fun, and full of adventure. I promise to be faithful and understanding, kind and forgiving. I promise to always be your best friend first and your lover second. I will always encourage you, grow with you, and never take you for granted. I promise to value our differences as much as our common ground. I promise to always have the patience our love demands and to speak when words are needed and to share the silence with you when they are not. I promise to always walk alongside you in this crazy ride called we call parenthood. And I promise to love you fiercely even when you snore. And my biggest promise to you is I will always hold off on watching the next episode of whatever show we're into until we can watch it together. I love you from Mrs. Regan. Come here. <laughs>